Meanwhile, Guatemalan police fired tear gas to disperse thousands of Honduran migrants trying to reach the United States on foot, with soldiers beating back a group trying to push through barricades. Take a look. In the name of curbing the spread of the coronavirus, security forces are under strict orders not to let anyone through, saying they are desperate to escape poverty, unemployment, gang and drug violence. And the aftermath of two devastating hurricanes, the migrants set out from Honduras last week, aiming to cross Guatemala and Mexico and reach the United States, an arduous journey of thousands of kilometers. Guatemala migration head Guillermo Diaz insisted the group will not be able to pass and urged the migrants to turn back. Anyone wishing to enter Guatemala would need legal travel documents and a negative COVID-19 test, he said in a video, and claimed to have intelligence information suggesting that members of organized crime gangs had infiltrated the migrant group. A first group of men, women and children, many wearing masks due to the pandemic, pushed their way Friday past police on the border on the border at El Florido. A police official said the initial group were allowed into Guatemala because there were many families with children. They said officers feared tear gas could cause casualties.